सीबीएसई क्लास ट्वेल्व प्रैक्टिकल स्किल्स इन केमिस्ट्री एक्सपेरिमेंट नंबर थ्री थर्मो केमिस्ट्री थ्री पॉइंट वन टू डिटरमाइन द एंथेल्पी ऑफ डिसोल्यूशन ऑफ कॉपर सल्फेट एम टू डिटरमाइन द एंथेल्पी ऑफ डिसोल्यूशन ऑफ कॉपर सल्फेट मेटीरियल सेक्वायर्ड 250 फिफ्टी एम एल ऑफ पॉलिथीन बॉटल रबर कॉक विथ टू होल्स थर्मोमीटर ग्लास टर बीकर्स कॉपर सल्फेट एंड डिस्टल वॉटर प्रोसीजर डिटर्मिनेशन ऑफ कैलोरी मीटर कॉन्स्टेंट दैट इज डब्ल्यू ऑफ कैलोरी मीटर पॉलिथीन बॉटल द रबर कॉक विथ टू होल्स इज फिटेड इन अ क्लीन पॉलिथीन बॉटल thermometer is inserted in one hole and stirrer is inserted in another hole the bulb of thermometer is kept about 1 cm above the stirrer 100 ml distilled water is put in the bottle water is stirred and its temperature is noted down let this temperature be t degree celsius in a 250 ml beaker take 100 ml of water and heat it up to about 60 degree celsius note the temperature of the water accurately let this temperature be th degree celsius Now add warm water from beaker to the polythene bottle and stir it. Note down its temperature quickly and let this temperature be Tm degree Celsius. Calculate the calorie meter constant for polythene bottle. using equation 3 determination of enthalpy of dissolution take 100 ml of distilled water in polythene bottle and fit a cork with two holes in it insert thermometer and stirrer in these two holes note the temperature and let it be t1 degree celsius 10 g copper sulfate powder is put in the bottle and cork is immediately put back mixture is stirred thoroughly and its temperature is noted on complete dissolution of copper sulfate Let this temperature be T2 degree Celsius. Observations. Result: enthalpy change in the dissolution of copper sulfate. Yes. 3.2 to determine the enthalpy of dissolution of potassium nitrate. aim to determine the enthalpy of dissolution of potassium nitrate materials required 250 ml polythene bottle measuring cylinder rubber cork with two holes thermometer glass stirrer beakers potassium nitrate and distilled water procedure determination of calorie meter constant for calorie meter polythene bottle same as experiment 
determination of enthalpy of dissolution of potassium nitrate. The rubber cock with two holes is fitted in a clean polythene bottle. Thermometer is inserted in one hole and stirrer is inserted in another hole. The bulb of thermometer is kept about 1 cm above the stirrer. 100 ml distilled water is put in the bottle. Water is stirred and its temperature is noted down. Let this temperature be T1 degree Celsius. 10 gram of potassium nitrate powder is put in the bottle and cork is immediately put back. Mixture is stirred thoroughly and its temperature is noted on complete dissolution of potassium nitrate. Let this temperature be T2 degree Celsius. Observations Result Enthalpy change in the dissolution of potassium nitrate is 3.3 Determining enthalpy of neutralization reaction between a strong acid like HCl and a strong base of NaOH. Aim Determining enthalpy of neutralization reaction between a strong acid HCl and a strong base NaOH. Materials required Beakers of 250 ml Thermometer calibrated to 0 0.10 degree Celsius. Glass stirrer. Wooden box. Tripod stand. Measuring cylinder. Wire gauze. 1.0 M NaOH solution. 1.0 M HCl. Distilled water. Paper. And Bunsen burner. Procedure. Determination of calorimeter constant of calorimeter beaker. Take 100 ml of distilled water in a 250 ml beaker marked X. Wrap the beaker by paper around its wall and put it into a thermally insulated box like wooden box. Insert thermometer and stirrer in the beaker X through the wooden box. Record the temperature of water. Let this temperature be Tc degree Celsius. Take 100 ml of hot water like 50 to 60 degrees Celsius in another beaker of capacity 250 ml marked Y. Note the temperature of hot water. Let this temperature be TH degree Celsius. Put the hot water contained in the beaker Y into beaker X. Stir the mixture of hot and cold water and note the temperature. Let this temperature be TM degree Celsius. Determination of heat of neutralization 100 ml of 1.0 m HCl is taken in a beaker whose calorimeter constant was determined earlier. The beaker is then kept in an insulated box. Its temperature is recorded after some time. Let this temperature be T1 degree Celsius. 100 ml of 1.0 m NaOH solution is taken in another beaker and its temperature is recorded. NaOH solution is added to beaker containing HCl solution. The mixture is stirred and its temperature is noted. Let the temperature be T2 degree Celsius. Observations Result Enthalpy change of neutralization of hydrochloric acid solution with sodium hydroxide solution is 3.4 To determine the enthalpy change during interaction hydrogen bond formation of acetone and chloroform Aim To determine the enthalpy change during interaction of acetone and chloroform Materials required Beaker of 250 ml Thermometer calibrated to 0.10 degree Celsius 
boiling tube glass stirrer wooden box cotton wool measuring cylinder wire gauze acetone chloroform and distilled water procedure calorimeter constant is determined as in previous experiment 50 ml acetone is taken in the beaker whose water equivalent was determined and it is kept in thermally insulated beaker its temperature is recorded after some time 50 ml chloroform is taken in another beaker and its temperature is noted both temperatures should be same chloroform is added in the previous beaker the mixture is stirred and its temperature is noted observations result enthalpy change during mixing of 50 ml of acetone with 50 ml of chloroform is 0.5